Instagram. I've told Sam so many times this because we we always go on about Instagram and, and a lot of the girls, you know, like that we're all quite friendly and um, we like to we like we like to like sort of have a joke with each other about really bad pitches. And if you've seen me play or you've seen SJ play and and Allison and you know we have very weird facials when we're playing, so we use a lot of pictures and stuff like that and have a bit of a joke. But I think it's a great way of. Social media with pictures, I think, is just... I mean, everyone doesn't want to read, do they? After a time, everyone gets a bit... And that goes my job. Thank you very much. (laughs) Bye-bye, people. I've just been retired. No, I mean, I like to read, but also I like to look at pictures. Do you know who I am, actually? (laughs) No, I just just got asked to sit down. I don't know. (laughs) Who are you? (laughs) I just think it's good, like, you know, and for for the kids who are playing and aspiring to be squash players, I think it's good that they see what we're up to and they see it by pictures, which for them... It's probably way more interactive than it is in any other way. Yeah, once again, I'm just been retired. Yeah. Um, what is your best, worst memory of squash? Do you know, my best and worst is probably the same at the same time. Mm-hmm. Um, was during the Commonwealth Games this, uh, last a year ago now, and um, I had a real high. I played Laura. The draw was really tough, and I, I knew that was the way it was going to be, but we really, like, the Welsh team really prepared very well for the mm-hmm. Commonwealth Games. We really made an effort to to make it what we wanted to get mm-hmm. out of it, and I think we did. We were unfortunate with Joel. He didn't get a medal, which I don't know how to this day. And um, We went to New Zealand for a week first, and we trained with the Kiwi team, which was great. Mm-hmm. And um, I was playing Laura Mazzaro, and uh, quarterfinals, you know, was packed out in Australia. I was so up for it, and I won, and I was just... Just that one of those moods where like it was amazing, you know, and the atmosphere was just electric, and so I was on a real high. And then the next day I played uh, Sarah Jane Perry, and I uh, was really looking forward to it, and I just got chopped. And I thought yeah. my whole dream of the Commonwealth Games was over in a minute, you know, and and uh, it was really weird because the day before I was on such a high, and then within. 24 hours, I was such a low again. And the worst part of it was I had to play the next day. Uh, and obviously, in normal PSA events, we mm. when we lose, we're out. That's so it, that's it. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. So um, it was sorry, this flies in my face. Yeah, tell you, it's going to die. <laughs> um, and I had to really. It was one of the worst nights ever. And I was playing Nicole the next day, and I was thinking, you know, everyone knows Nicole is such a legend, and I was like, God, like you know, you had such an opportunity, blah blah. I didn't play. I wanted to play and and hit an all-time low, if I'm honest. And Dave was there, and he was really good in sort of saying to me, before you got here, you told me if you were playing for that bronze medal, you would have, you know, bitten my arm off. And now you're here, like, depressed because you've lost. So that was probably a weird bit of a bow. Um, that was kind of a in the same in the same moment. Yeah, telling you bronze. And, you know. Yeah, and then obviously the next day then, I, I beat Nicole for the first time ever um, and take a bronze medal home, which was amazing and so I had three days where I was high low high and it was really exhausting then we had to play doubles afterwards <laughs> which was amazing as well but I've never felt the high and the low so quickly together um, so that was probably one of my best and worst couple time. of days at the same time I've had obviously really great moments at different times like probably winning the nationals the first time yeah. it's got to be up there um, beating Laura and then beating Alison in two days was was really good and um, I think in I'm not sure of the year whether it was twenty uh, what we now yeah twenty fourteen I did my ankle really bad at the nationals and I was out for like five months four or five months and that was probably an all time low yeah because it really made me realise that I actually wanted to play I think before that I was kind of yeah I really love it I'm enjoying playing you know I'm having fun I'm travelling around blah blah but that really made me realise how much you love it yeah. Probably, well, probably turned it around. I'm happy with that. Yeah. Thank you very much. Thank, Thank you. you very much. Thank you.